what we did was to use this technology on a mouse with cancer metastasis and we could see all these details. Overall, science also thinking different out of the box, right? Yeah. And um, that's exactly the same for art. You have to think different to create something new. And that has been quite part of my science, how we can go to the next level to create something, to create some images of um, structures that we look for the first time someone has never seen. Well, we couldn't do imaging larger samples, and that's what the new microscope for us uh, comes for. So it, we can now, we are able to image samples uh, as large as whole mouse body and even large human organs. That's a big improvement. So it seems that you're always pushing the boundaries of light sheet microscopy. What was the reaction of your colleagues when they first saw a 3D cleared entire mouse? When I actually started communicating this project with my team, the first reaction was, oh, we cannot do that, it's too big to image. But then we work on this problem hard, and we were really excited to see all these amazing details on the intact mouse. And later, actually, to, uh, what we did was to use this technology on a mouse with cancer metastasis. So if it comes to cancer, what would you say is the main advantage of using the ultramicroscope blaze. So it allows us to see every single cancer cell head to toe compared to prior methods where you can see only large tumors like in MRI or bioluminescence. Now we can see every single cancer metastasis in the body and we can also see if whether drugs are targeting all these tiny micrometastases. And I think this will be quite powerful for drug development in oncology. So comparing the new ultramicroscope technology to the standard imaging technologies, what is the big advantage of using the ultramicroscope blaze? For us, light sheet microscopy in combination with tissue cleaning is very powerful because we can look at the big picture and see all details in unbiased way, then focus on the cells and molecular mechanisms. And that is for us very critical. For us, there's a two uh, clear targets. One, to be able to scan whole mouse at a more high throughput way, maybe multiple mouse at the same time being imaged within a few hours that we can do drug screening. In addition, we are very interested in scanning the whole cleared human brain, where potentially we need to think about uh, whole light sheet microscopy from a new perspective.